Hello, I'm Spanish Fort United Methodist Church. I'm Jennifer Robertson and I'm the children's um, director at our church. And I'm here to do the pray down at noon with you guys. Um, today, I just wanted to um, take a moment and, um, you know, I'm very excited that we will be um, celebrating our seniors this Sunday. Um, we will be doing a special moment. Miss Brittany will be doing a special moment. And um, we also celebrated our pre-K students who will be going on to kindergarten. Um, so today, I just really wanted to take a moment and, um, Pray for those of us who are in transition, um, maybe due to a new jobs through um, COVID, maybe through going on to uh, their new stage of education and life, um, maybe those who are in retirement. Um, really just wanting to pray um, for our, all of us who, um, as we're in transition into going back into um, what we're calling our new normal. And so today, um, I just want to pray for that. And I wanted to, at the end of it, we will be saying the Lord's Prayer. And I hope that you will say that with me. So let's um, go to the Lord uh, in prayer today. Dear Heavenly Father, I just want to thank you for this day. I want to thank you for the sunshine and the wind and the um, beautiful day that we have, Lord. I just want to pray today in thanks for all of our seniors who will be moving on um, to continue their education um, as they have made decisions to um, go on in this next stage of life. Lord, I pray that you will be with them. Lord, I pray that you will um, help to guide them in, in these next few um, months as to um, what you may want them to do to continue their education um, that will ultimately glorify you, Lord. Um, I pray that you will um, help them to know that their church family is ultimately so proud of them and that they are loved by us um, and that we are always here to the, for them, guiding them and willing to um, be a listening ear as they continue into this new um, place in their life. Lord, I thank you for the pre school students, the four-year-olds who will in this coming months be going to kindergarten. Um, Lord, I pray that you be with their parents um, for this new step into education um, and what that looks like, Lord, um, as we return to school. Um, Lord, I pray that you will be with them to be excited about their their learning. And I thank you for the preschool teachers and our preschool that um, shared with them the love of God, love of Christ. And, and a love of learning, Lord. We, we thank you for um, that amazing school and what they have done to prepare um, these students to go into kindergarten. Lord, I pray that you will be with us and as our church family, as we continue to figure out what our new normal is, Lord, as we all seem to go back to work. And I pray with all of those who are making decisions about how to um, meet guidelines and recommendations to um, even with the rising cases of COVID right here in our very own state that um, we know we have to get back to normal life, Lord. I pray that you protect us, you give us wisdom, and then give us guidance as to how to do that, Lord. I pray that you be with our own church as we, we make these decisions and our church leaders, our, um, Bill and Rebecca and those who are involved in all of the decisions that will be made so that we can once again have a glorious celebration of being together as a church family when that time is, is here, Lord. I pray that you will just um, guide us and be with us. Lord, I pray for those who um, may be um, embarking on new new things um, in this time, Lord, new, new jobs, um, new responsibilities, um, maybe even uh, retiring, Lord. I know that there are so many out there who, are, who have um, retired and are going through this transition and I think that it makes it um, very, very difficult during this time of, of um, getting back to normal when it's not normal, Lord. And I pray that you will, you will be with us and give us wisdom and guidance, um, that you will um, help us to, and protect us as we continue to do this, and that you will truly um, help us to feel your presence um, through this entire um, process. Lord, it's um, in your name that you've taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy name is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Amen. I hope that you guys will join us on Sunday. Um, again, like I said, live on Facebook as we continue to um, do our virtual worship service. Um, I hope that you will um, be there to help us celebrate our seniors during our graduation moment that will be happening virtually. Um, Miss Brittany, our youth director, will be doing. And if you can't catch us on Facebook Live, I hope that you will join us at 103.3 um, on the radio at 12 o'clock um, as you can hear our service then. Um, I hope that you guys have a wonderful Saturday and I hope that you will join us on Sunday. 
way for our worship um, online virtual. And um, we can't wait to see you. So I hope you have a great weekend. Talk to you soon. Bye.